In this video, we're gonna talk about the differences between the R4G and the R4G Lite. So let's hop right into the differences. This is the R4G and this is the R4G Lite. Obviously, you're gonna notice a little bit of a body change. The light is a little bit more slimmer, maybe a little bit more taller. And that is because we cut out a lot of the internals that we didn't need when we went to a photo only mode for light. So I do wanna say that one of the differences is that the R4G does video and photo mode and the R4G light does only photo mode. The light comes with a significantly smaller antenna. The antenna on the R4G is a 9 dB gain antenna and the antenna on the R4G light is a 7 dB gain antenna. The reason we dropped down the camera size on the R4G light is simply just because that the R4G light doesn't have to push video data over the network. And we were able to go to a 7 dB gain antenna and still get that quality reception that we were shooting for. Speaking of the antenna on the R4G light, the R4G has a folding antenna just like the R4G. However, the light, you're able to fold down and put the antenna in place makes a good carrying model if you have to put it in a bag without worrying about breaking the antenna. So the next thing I want to point out on the R4G light is that there is no LCD screen. On the R4G light, we went to an LED model like face to kind of show the user what's going on in the camera. It's a very simple interface. We were able to cut costs and get rid of the LCD screen. On the R4G, on the other hand, the inside has an LCD screen where you can actually change your settings, you can view the viewport, you can view your images right on the device. Most of the settings, actually all of the settings, except for the format button, is done through the mobile application with the R4G Lite. Whereas on the R4G, you can use the LCD screen to do just about everything you can do on the app. While I have this open, you're gonna notice that the R4G has 12 AA batteries. The batteries are included in the inside of the camera and then it just closes up. On the R4G Lite, the R4G has eight AA batteries and it's in a tray. You press the eject button on the bottom of the device, a tray will pop out and that's where you have your batteries. 